Uh, yo guys, what's going on? Halenerd here, and today I'm just showing you a quick tutorial on uh, how to fix your, uh, Morellimus action, Morellius, I don't know how to say it, action, uh, audio desyncs. So basically what your problem is, usually at the beginning of your video, the audio is perfectly fine, it's all synced up, but like, during the middle of the video, and towards the end, the audio is like three seconds late, four seconds late, five seconds late, and it keeps on getting late, and, uh, you know, it's really annoying. So basically what you want to do is, um... Whatever you're recording with in here, if you're using the crop, the desktop, or the gaming thing, if you're doing like Minecraft or whatever other gaming thing, I would recommend doing the controller one, because I record your thing without having to crop it or whatever. Uh, you're going to want to record system sounds and allow multi-channel audio recording. Now you're going to want to check this. This is one of the most important things, and uh, basically once you check those, those are all good. Uh, these settings don't doesn't really matter. Uh, I would keep them to my settings that I have right now, because those are the best things to use. In my opinion. So yeah, once you're done, you'll go to this little uh, gear symbol. And once you click that, we'll go to the uh, audio thing. So over here, you can see that it's my mic. I don't have my other mic plugged in. I don't know why. I'm using my other ones. So here, you'll just press whatever you want. System default headphones. I would recommend using your headphones or your speakers. Uh, I kept my audio and my microphone, uh, my game audio and my microphone uh, to 1550. And uh, the other important thing here is to check this. So once you have this checked and uh, this checked, you're all good. So basically now after that, uh, you're going to want to download this one program uh, called Audio Stream Splitter. And basically what that does is it splits your audio. And the purpose of this and uh, this is so that it records not only it records your mic and your game audio, but it splits it. So yeah, so uh, once we put like uh, the video I recorded here, uh, let's all you gotta do is put it in there. You press run. Don't worry, it's not a virus, guys. And uh, see, look, it'll already create these two things. As you can see, here is my uh, mic, my uh, audio, my commentary. Yeah, and then here's my game audio. So yeah. Now, basically, after that, uh, that's basically it, uh, but if you're wondering how to combine this, the unfortunate part is I'm pretty sure you'll, you will have to have a video editor. I use Cyberlink PowerDirector, so basically what you want to do here, I don't know if yours is like this, it'll take a while to load. I will speed this up just for you guys, just so I can make it fast. But yes, make sure, this will not, we don't, you don't have to care about this unless you're like doing post commentary or whatever. Just record, just remember you have this checked and uh, this checked. Those are the things that'll make this work and uh, yeah. So as you can see here, we are uh, using, we're in our project director, whatever. And uh, basically in my thing, I'm just going to take my video clip, put it in there. <clears throat> okay, put my commentary, my uh, brain fart, uh, my game audio, and yes. So once that's there, as you can see, um, there won't be probably there will probably be no like no um audio sync over here since it's such a small video. But as you can see, uh, you can hear my audio. So if you can somehow for your first video, uh, take out the audio, which is just by pressing this button for me, uh, it automatically mutes it. So then you would want to put, wait, what is this? Is this my, okay, so you would want to put your uh, game audio right here and your commentary audio right here. So then once you put that, basically you want to take out the video. That's just if, you know, if like, no, you, you can keep these on, but I usually just keep them off. So as you can see, you can hear the audio. So yeah, basically that's it, guys. Uh, the part you probably will get mad at is the uh, um, editing program. Honestly, it depends on what uh, editing program you have. Uh, I know I use Cyberlink PowerDirector. So yeah, uh, if you guys have the option of like um, not showing the video but putting on the audio, uh, that would be cool. Uh, just basically do that except ha only have the picture up. Uh, same with the audio. And basically once that's done, you're done. You have that all good. Now your audio wouldn't won't be bad. Your audio won't be like desynced and all that um poop. So yeah, that's how you do it. If you guys did enjoy this video, make sure you smash that like button. And also, 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 I don't know what to say. Also, you uh the link to the um 
sh audio splitter will be linked in the description. It'll be a, a media fire page, and it, it's not a virus, people. If you click the download button and, like, a new tab pops open, just X out. Uh, make sure you do that kind of quick, though, just so you don't have those weird, like, ad pops up and stuff. But, yeah, once that's done, uh, that's it. Uh, basically, what I did, though, uh, just an ad to thing, I would go to my videos, make a new folder. Uh, like, since I do commentaries, I would do, like, um, create a new folder and call it MC Commentary. Or whatever commentary, like, COD Commentary, whatever. So, as you can see here, I would put my splitter in there. My audio stream splitter. It's gonna look like this, people. And, uh, just put your video in, and you put it in, and you should get your little two files. So, yes, guys, that's it for this video. If you did enjoy, please make sure you smash that like button. Hope this helped. And, as always, peace out.